As we speak, US airlines such as Delta, American, United and others are landing their planes and crews to the evacuation effort of US personnel and other people in need from Afghanistan. That whole operation is under the command of the US Department of Defense. Those airlines have been made to do so by a Civil Reserve Air Fleet arrangement. That fleet was formed in 1952 and this is only the third time in history it was activated. Airlift of troops for Iraq in 1990 and 2003 were the other two occasions. The arrangement stipulates that airlines can promise to help the US military when called upon. In return, those airlines get paid for augmenting the regular US Air Force airlift fleet via annual contracts. 18 planes have been called upon so far, and they will not fly directly to Kabul airport in Afghanistan. Instead, they will relieve US military transports on routes from Germany and Qatar to US, so those can then fly to Kabul.